Hi, welcome to the Road to Passive Income. I'm Brianna, and today I'm going to do a My Lead Gen Secret tutorial. First, I want to start off and go through the different menus, different areas, and just to make sure that you are familiar with them. So right here is the home section and it provides some of your, well, your stats and also the previous mailings, emails that you've sent. And it gives you a glimpse of how many leads you're receiving a day. Um, today is 200, yesterday 200, and then it has the bonus leads for today 100. And once you receive your first sale, it will increase to 200 leads a day. Next, you have the My Leads section, and let me just sign back in. You have the My Leads section, and this is where all your leads are located, and it has the dates from, for each set of leads. So it's like, you know, 200, I think it was like, see, September the 15th, I had the first sale, so from the 15th all the way up to today, it will be 200 each day. Like So it's 200 on each of these lists. And, for, and if I were to click here, it would actually show the leads, but I don't want to expose that personal information. And so this is where you can gather your leads. And you can also, if you click there, you can select all of them and download. You can download all the leads from all pages by clicking this button or you just want to download the leads that's like on the current page, then you just click download my leads. Next, we have the master email swipes. This is the, these are some of the swipes that you can use to promote the My Lead Gen Secret System. And I, I have used um, one of these and I, I did receive a sell from, so they definitely work. And then you have the mailing system, which I will be going over today. And this is where you would actually submit your email to your leads. You have statistics, and this uh, gives a detailed overview of your emails, the opt-in rates, the um, click rates, and also has the graphs. And um, you can look through here, like, in this column see how many has opened your emails and then the total total of leads the email was sent and then I always look in this column the clicks and amount of clicks that I receive and and then we have the affiliates section in this session if you click right here um, it actually show you like the commissions and um, I actually showed this in previous videos and then you have your downline um, right here and so um, currently have two members that signed up and then that's just one um, like an older member that I have so we go to um, promo tools and this is where you will find all your affiliate links. So far, I've been getting results with this page, the Sizzle page. And um, I recommend you using that one. Then you have the compensation plan. And it um, provides a breakdown. Then also we have affiliate emails that you can use. And there's actually one that I used, this one. So this email I used, I actually made a sale from, and um, I definitely recommend you trying this one out and also these other ones in here. So you have the recommended advertising section and in this section, you have other affiliate programs that you could join, other traffic sources that you can join.
So in this section, it has the recommended uh, advertising. These are other traffic sources so you can use, other affiliate programs that you can become a part of. And once you join one of these um, systems, you can actually input your affiliate ID. So whoever is in your downline, if they decide to sign up for the same system, you would actually earn a commission from um, this particular system. And then on over, you have your account where you can make changes as far as like your payment methods, the way you want to get paid, if it's check or PayPal, um, update your email address or those type changes. And we're going to go to the mailing system. And the first step is choosing an email swipe, or you could actually write your own email. If you're great at copywriting, um, you could go ahead and just write your own email if you feel comfortable with that. Or you can use an email swipe. And in this case, I'm, I'm just going to use one of the master swipes. So just go to the master email swipes. And what's so very convenient about this, you can just select one of these emails. Just, I'm just going to choose one that I haven't used before to try it out. So this one, I'm going to use, a, I don't, don't remember using this one before, so let's use this one. And then just click on the import, let me go back. So I just clicked right here, import email number 16 to mailing system. Once you click that, it will automatically populate your email here. Your, you have your subject line, it's already added. And then you have your email message in the body section is already preloaded for you. And then if you want to, I like to add the first name in the subject line. And sometimes I add the first name, the subject line to make it more personalized. And like hi, and then the name, comma. And so, and then next, you'll want to Go ahead and get your affiliate link. So as you can see right here, it says insert your URL here. So you need to get your affiliate link. Now we go over to the affiliates section. And I'm just going to open that up in another tab. So here are the affiliate links. Um, you have the sales page that you use, the sizzle page, which is the one that I use in um, getting results with. So I'm just going to stick with that one. Um, but you also have the info page and splash page. And um, you can use one of these as well. But so far, this is the one that has been converting for me. So I'm just going to copy that link and then you can either paste it here um, or you can just embed the link and cite this statement here. And sometimes I will do that so in this case, I'm just going to 
embedded inside here made this sentence a hyperlink paste here and then on the end you would add the end sign src and that's the source and then an equal sign m l G oh actually for the source it would be the name of the the page that I'm using. So I'm using the sizzle page. So you would just type in sizzle so you know which page actually converted. Once the once you make a sale, you would be able to look at the source, the tag source that the person has when they sign up under your link and so I have the tag here sizzle or the source here sizzle and then at today's date 10 0521 at the end so you know the date and then just to verify going to reference one of my older emails or not that one, uh, but one where I'm promoting the My Legion secret. And so we have it here, the end, sign SRC equals sizzle. And then it has the current date with a date. So it looks like I did it correctly over here. And it doesn't matter, the S can be capitalized and the other letters lowercase, or you could do all caps. So just add the and sign, and sign, SRC equals sizzle, and then the current date. And that way you keep track of which page actually converted for you when that mem member signed up. And then also you'll know the date. So you can, you'll know like, oh, okay, I sent this email, email out on that date. Click on OK. I like to make it bold. The colon I can get rid of. And then I will add at the top like hey and then first name or hi. Oh, well, let me move it all the way to the top. Then first name. So hi, and then first name, and then, and then looks like I can add another link here because it says click here now to get any commission pay payments sent to your bank account so right there I would add the link and the easier way to do is just copy from here and then paste it here and then bold You would want to add your signature. A it helps if you add a photo of yourself at the bottom, along with your email and your Facebook Messenger. If you don't mind them connect, connecting with you on Facebook, and then some members actually add their phone number. If you feel comfortable, you got your phone number to the bottom. But for this one, I actually have, well, I can actually copy right here. I have my photo and then just a PS message you can add at the end. And then I'm going to paste it here. 
of the PS message uh, could be like a, a statement at the end to try to catch their eye or I would say maybe grab their attention or just something you want to tell them before they actually leave, like before they leave the email or the message, something that could kind of like impact them. And so for my PS message, I have connect with me after you start receiving your daily leads. And then I actually embedded a hyperlink, I mean a link in here. And for this one, I need to change the date to the current date on the end. And I actually um, was able to get this PS from one of the email swipes that is within the My Lead Gen Secret Facebook group. And so it's very helpful that helpful the Facebook group. They have many resources and tools inside there. So now I have everything in my email. I just want to make the font consistent, the font size. And then you want to make sure that you select all the leads. You can do the mailing type, mail by lead partner or mail by lead date. And if you select mail by lead partner, it actually lists like a different types of partners. But the mail by date is easier. To me, it's clear um, to understand and it simplifies it so these are just the dates and you can see the 200 leads I'm getting each day and then just click here select all then it will move the leads to this side and it's letting you know that it's 13,600 leads that selected and these are the leads that you will be emailing next before you even click on send, you want to want to preview it. So I click here and then it's just click on these links to make sure they work. So all of them are working. And then you can also include your YouTube channel and the signature and oh yeah and then your Facebook your email and so I just test this one out and so that one comes up is working and then you have the option we could do the perfect timing and this is where they will send the email to the lead based on the time that they based on the time that the lead will actually be checking their emails and it goes by the history like let's say if if um daniel like a lead named daniel opens up your email from yesterday he yesterday he opened it up at five o'clock p.m so when you email when you email your leads today, he should receive his email, like your email should go to his inbox at five o'clock PM today, since he opened up the email at five o'clock PM yesterday. So it goes by the history of the opens. And it's the system is able to predict when they would open up the email. So you can either select that option. Um, recently, I found out a tip from the Facebook group that you can also not do the perfect timing. And it kind of makes you stand out some because they were saying if you do the perfect timing, that's when everybody else 
are sending their emails. So to kind of stand out, you can just not do the perfect timing. I have been doing the perfect timing for each email, but for the last email I sent out, I didn't do it just to try it out. So I think for this one, I'm not going to do to do the perfect timing and just see how it goes, the results. So we'll leave that unchecked, but um, if you want to, you can check it, the perfect timing. So it looks like the email is ready. Everything's set up and then you could just double check. Now we go ahead, go ahead and push send. Okay, and so it says it has been added to the queue. And then you could go to the statistics page. Click here and you can see it shows my email has been sent today on October the 5th and the total leads has been sent, sent out to. And for the past few days, I, I haven't been emailing. Last email was October the 1st. So today, since I sent the email, I'm starting back to email. But um, you want to do it every day, like emailing daily is good and as you can see I was emailing like every day consistently and um, you will have those days where you just get too busy and you know you don't get a chance to send that email out <laughs> and then you just have to you know just get back on track just get back in there and send the email and then what's great about it if you're pressed for time you can just go in here in the master email swipes and then just grab a swipe um, or in the affiliate section on the promo tools, go ahead in here, click on import the email and just, you know, load it up and you'll be done. Oh yeah, add your affiliate links before you send it and then your signature and you'll be done. And so... That's... It as far as the steps and mailing in the My Legion secret system, and then as I mentioned in the other videos, I do have bonuses. And let me show you. So, for the bonuses, I will provide access to our Facebook group, and in that group, they have additional resources swipes and tips and then people explain like their experience and the things they did to generate sales and then also I provide a traffic generation guide as well and it explains like different traffic methods you can use and where you can learn even more about different platforms and different ways of traffic and also I provide support if you need help getting started, I'm here to help you and and also answer any questions you may have. And then um, I definitely share with you the emails I've used that that has converted for me. And then like any um, tips or resources that would help you, I'm more than happy to provide them for you. And I highly recommend the My Legion Secret System. It is a great system and just email every day. You will get a sale and um, just being patient and consistent. And so um, just go ahead and sign up for the My Lead Gen Secret System. Sign up at the link in the description below and go ahead and sign up and get started. And um, and make sure you just email every day. 
So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and thank you for tuning in.